What up, though? Heist Man Defoe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Man, Billy Porter, I think he's gonna do him a new movie called The Highlander. Y'all remember The Highlander? The movie about the immortals and they gotta cut each other's head off so there can only be one. There can be only one. That's what he's doing right now, man. He's going at it with this dude right here named Harry Styles. And they going at it. Or he, I don't think they going at it, but he, he ain't liking the fact that Harry Styles got to do a, um, a Vogue cover. You know, hold on. This is what it is. Y'all yeah, remember this? Harry Styles wore that dress. And he was in Vogue. So Billy Porter, he kind of mad about it. He put out a tweet. He said, I feel like the fashion industry has accepted me because they have to. Mm, mm, mm. He said it in Sunday Times. He said, I created a conversation about non-binary fashion, and yet Vogue still puts Harry Styles, a straight white man, in a dress on the cover for the first time. That's his tweet. Well, he said that in, um, we call that, uh, the Sunday Times. He also said, so I was the first one to do it, and now everybody's doing it. He said, I'm not dragging Harry Styles, but he doesn't care. He's just doing it because it's the thing to do. This is politics for me. This is my life. I had to fight my entire life. I had to fight my whole life. That's what he said. He said I had to fight my entire life so I can wear a dress to be at the Oscars, he pointed out. Um, I don't know. Do y'all think he has a beef? I mean, he did wear this dress back in the days, not too long ago. I mean, I've made a, um, I've been drew the dress out. And I did talk that talk on, when I was drawing my pictures out back in the days. Look at this. Um, so he, he might be, he wanted to, like I said, he's the Highlander. There can only be one. What you want to say about this guy? I see you over there in the corner looking. I, I think Billy Porter is correct that he was uh, he helped pioneer to be more acceptable. Yes. But Harry Styles is a little higher echelon of uh, like A list, B list. You know what I'm saying? Right. That I think that is more so why he's on the cover more so than because he's a white male. I think it's because... He brought race into it and all yeah. that. Yeah. Well, sometimes race needs to be included in things, but I don't necessarily think this time. Harry Styles is known for bending gender fashion. Right. Um. But I think Harry Styles is a little bit more of an A-list celebrity than Billy Porter is. I'm not taking away from Billy Porter, because I love Billy Porter. Right. But I think that's why he landed the cover of Vogue rather than Billy did. And Billy's a little salty. I mean, he's salty right now. He still got to fight Kid Cudi and, and what's my man named Russell Westbrook. They wore dresses too. I don't think they did it on, on the level of um, Harry Styles on making the Vogue magazine. But you think he got a beef? No, he's he, not the first. He just want to be the Highlander. He just want to be the only one. I know, he's just a little salty. He want to be the only one in the dress, yo. Billy Porter, relax. You cannot be the only one in, wearing a dress. Anyway, man, we definitely going to be talking about this Friday right here on this channel because I go live talking about stuff just like this every Friday. Y'all need to come through and holler at me, man. Um, Friday at 9 p.m. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button. There ain't, there ain't no comment button. Hit the like button, the comment section, the all them notification bells you got. I messed that all up, man. Anyway, I'll let you boy, Heist Man the Foe. Talk there, talk ghetto news and opinions. Peace.